Hello viewers again. Um, I would just like to uh, introduce our Mayor of the Alexandrina Council, uh, Keith Parks. Uh, thanks, thanks very much. Thanks, yeah. thanks Keith for coming along. And we're just going to be mentioning uh, about the right to take water levy again on our farms. And Keith, um, you know, congratulations on your appointment and uh, the community really appreciates the way that, uh, you know, you listen, you come and talk to everybody. Uh, and you've got a very good rapport with the everyday person, which is really much appreciated. But look, do you mind if I just ask you, what's your view on this right to take water levy, being charged for water that falls freely from the sky onto our farms? Well, I, I, my position is that, you know, that, that the water that lands on a person's property uh, is their water. Um, it, I mean, they're not, they're not diverting it all and keeping it and preventing their neighbour from having some of it. I mean, that's... It's on their land, it's their water, they shouldn't be charged for it. I mean, we live in a region um, where primary production is our biggest source of income. We live in a region which we produce the best primary produce in, the, in Australia, if not the world. It's pristine. Yes. Now, this is, like a, this is like a tax on producing quality product. We're going to restrict our farmers from, from supplying the most important commodity we've got, which is food. Exactly, and uh, we all know it's a critical need. We can't do without it. Uh, and not only that, Keith, you know, the cost, what, what's, what's the cost that's going to be added to production? Uh, and, I mean, people are doing it hard now. Uh, they can't afford an extra cost on food. No, it's just make, it'll just make food, uh, number one, more expensive. Uh, it puts farmers, and we all know how hard life is on, uh, in a, for a farmer running, trying to run a property and sus be sustainable and make a dollar. Um, and that's what the investment's all about. That's why they're doing it. And they're producing quality products. They're, they're really enhancing the community and, and where we live. So that they shouldn't be penalised by being charged for the water that lands on their land. They're not dragging it from their neighbour's place onto their place. Exactly. It's, it's, their, it's their water. Yep. Um, you know, that's, that's fair. Well, I, I think you made some very good points there. And uh, you mentioned about the community. I mean, if, if the farmer's not doing well, We've got less money to spend in businesses in town, and and uh, just so our viewers know, Strathalbyn, where we are at the moment, we're alongside the Angus River here at the Soldiers Memorial Reserve in Strathalbyn, and our population here is about five and a half thousand. We've got beautiful historic buildings. The ambience is magnificent. We get a lot of tourists that come through here, and uh, you know we we don't want people paying exorbitant amount for food, and there's no need for this. No, we need to stimulate. We need to stimulate all sectors of our economy, and primary production is the primary production is the most important. And we're trying to encourage investment, and we're trying to encourage people to buy our produce. So that's what our, the whole state's about, not just this area here. Um, we need to we need to develop that more and more, and um, it's an area we can grow, and it's just a big plus. Everything we do in that area, so we might, we've got to stop kicking primary producers. Uh, just so our viewers know, we, uh, we are very lucky here in the Alexandrina Council to have Keith Parks that support all of us and has got some common sense, mind you, uh, but uh, Keith just mentioned about the state. This is not just about certain areas, this right to take water levy, whether we use it or not, mind you. Uh, this is not just about eastern Mount Lofty Ranges or western Mount Lofty Ranges. This is farmers all over the state should not be paying a levy. So, uh, is there anything else you'd just like to say uh, in uh, in closing, Keith? No, I just appreciate uh, talking to you, Peter, and uh, and I wish all our primary producers uh, all the all the best for the coming season. Thank you very much for your support.